Hey, what's up everybody? I already found all barns in Forza Horizon 3 and I hope this guide can help you when you're struggling with one. Ready? I'm ready. We're ready. Oh, it's beautiful. Well, I mean, you know, it's a bit covered in mud and slime and whatever that thing is, but, oh, boss, that is a Ferrari Dino under there. Let me get it back to the shop and cleaned up. Then you'll see what I'm talking about. For the second one, my capture card didn't work properly. That's why you already see the real find of it and not the way how I was searching for it. Best part of my job, right here. Old Land Cruiser, nice. You can't kill a Land Cruiser. They kept bringing out new models, but they really shouldn't have bothered. All the ones from the 70s are still running fine. I'll still take the landy back to the garage, give it a once over. I'll let you know when you can have it. I am way too excited right now. Seventy-three Falcon XB, five point eight liter V eight, main force patrol interceptor, fuel injected suicide machine. <laughs> you might have to give me a minute. Yeah, sorry about that outburst. It's an Australian thing. I'll get it cleaned up and...
to open her up. Will you look at those lines? This isn't just any Ferrari. This is a 166. First car they ever won Le Mans with. The car that started it all. And the poor thing looks like it's been sandblasted. I'm taking this Ferrari back to the garage and restoring it to its former glory. I'll call you when I'm done. Come on, what have you got for me? I can't even see it under there, is that? No, it can't be. It looks like one of the rarest and most valuable Maseratis ever made, currently being used as a bookshelf. Mate, if I'm right, this is huge. Give me a chance to get it fixed up at the shop, yeah? Let's see what all the fuss was about. <laughs> it's a reliant regal. This is a classic piece of British motoring history. You keep digging up classics at this rate, and this time next year, you'll be a millionaire. I'll get this cute little guy fixed up. Should still be a hoot to drive when it's finished. Come on, the suspense is killing me. No way is that a Ford Woody. It is. It's a Ford Woody. This thing is like a priceless antique. It's like finding a Rembrandt in your garage. Well, for me it is. I'm taking you back to the shop, surfboard and all. I'll let you know when you can have it. And who's our next contestant? Hmm, looks like a Skyline GTR. The V-Spec. Back in the 90s, these things ran right in the Aussie touring car circuit. I'll 
I'll get it back to the shop and get to work. Feel free to check in if you like. The order from the next 5 barn finds might not be right. So if those are not the ones you're searching for, just skip to the next one and see if that's the right one. It's definitely there, but maybe not in the red order. Would you like to do the honors? That is a Lamborghini, believe it or not. The LM002 was supposed to be a luxury car you could take off-road. Looks like this one's been hitting the dirt too hard. The suspension's gone. I'll take this back to the shop. Replace the springs, clean it up. Won't take long. Oh, I love this part. That's an FX. That's the first Ute Holden ever made. That is Australia's gift to the motoring world, right there. However, oh, this one smells like it's had goats living in it. I'll take it back to the garage. You just wait till I get it cleaned up and retuned. Okay, time to open her up. Sixty-nine Dodge Charger Daytona. Look at the size of that wing. This is a custom NASCAR racer. What's it doing all the way out here? I'll get the Charger back to the shop. See if I can get it fixed up and maybe find out how it wandered so far from home in the first place. Sorry that for this one a part of the video is missing. 1973. Sorry, it's just this is an emotional moment for an Australian. Taking the Monaro back to the shop. I just need some time alone with this thing. Y you can have it soon. This is going to be a good one, I just know it. Oh boss, we stand in the presence of greatness. The Holden Sandman. 
See that faded paint? That's the sea witch livery. It's not a custom job. Holden had it like that in the brochure. Back to the garage. I'll get this fixed up and give you a call, all right? You... Okay, wow me. Dune buggy, cool. This is a Myers Max. I always wanted one of these when I was a kid. Actually, I wanted a Lamborghini Countach, but I figured I couldn't take it on the beach. I'll take it back to the shop. We'll have you blasting across the dunes in no time. And that's it. I hope it was helpful, ladies. I'll see you next time, and make sure to follow. And take a look at my streams on Twitch. you find the link in the description. Bye-bye.